All right, so in this video, I'm going to be talking about how to implement functions using decoders. Basically, any combinational circuit can be constructed using decoders as well as OR gates. This is due to the property of decoders being able to generate the min terms in a separate manner. And then if we have all the min terms generated separately, we can just take the ones that we need and apply them to the inputs of an OR gate and thus get the function that we're interested in. One classic example of that is if you're asked to implement the full adder circuit using a decoder as well as a couple of OR gates. Now, the first of all, you need to know your full adder equations, and assuming that you know these, then the second thing you need to do is realize how many input variables that you have. So we already know that any decoder would take n inputs and have as output 2 to, the, 2 to the power of n outputs. In this case, by examining the full adder equations, it's very easy to realize that for both of the sum and the carry, we have three inputs, basically the three bits to be added together. So we know that we need to use a 3 by 8 decoder. Now, if just looking at the equation or the Boolean expression for the summation, it's very easy to see that we have the summation of the midterms 1, 2, 4, and 7. So what you're going to do is you're going to sketch a rectangle depicting your 3 by 8 decoder. You're going to have your three input variables, x, y, and z, input to the decoder. And then at the output, you're just going to choose the outputs 1, 2, 4, and 7, and take these outputs, have them as inputs to an OR gate, and the output of this OR gate would represent your summation of the full adder. And then you're going to do the same for the carry, so you realize that the carry Boolean expression is given by the summation of min terms 3, 5, 6, and 7, and having these taken as outputs from the decoder and fed into the inputs of an OR gate, then you have an output of a carry to the full adder. Now, in case you don't know or don't mem didn't memorize earlier the Boolean expressions for, let me just cancel that, for the sum and the carry, what you would have to do is that you need to write down your truth table, having the three inputs, and you already know that having three inputs, then the number of rows in such a truth table would be to the power of three, which is eight, basically. And then you have a couple of columns, one representing the carry and the other representing the sum. And from this truth table, then you can write down your two Boolean expressions, or just read off the from the columns of the carry and the sum, where you have ones, and these ones represent the, the min terms that you need to add and feed into your sum and carry. I hope this short video has been uh, useful to you in understanding how to implement functions using decoders. Keep in mind that while I'm just showing this or uh, treating in this video the case of a full adder, you can actually use or implement any other circuit um, using uh, uh, an n by two to the power of n decoder. It could be composed of not just three variables, but more than that.